And days after the body cam footage of Tyree Nichols was released, the discussion of how body camera footage in our state could be sparking up again. Nine on your sides, Caitlin Richards joins us in the studio after speaking with one NC lawmaker. And Caitlin, what did they say? Courtney, some would consider North Carolina to be one of the strictest states when it comes to body camera footage being released. But right now it's unclear if those strict laws could change. Under North Carolina law, footage from body cameras worn by law enforcement is not considered public record. Therefore, by law, police and sheriff departments cannot release footage on their own. Here's where it can get tough and what makes our state different. In order for this footage to be released, there must be a petition sent to the court, and that's when a judge decides whether if the full video gets released or just part of it. We need to be more transparent when people are reaching out, wanting to understand to make sure that when they say we are here to help people, we want to make sure everybody know that we did everything we could. You're not hiding anything with the body cams. I mean, you can't go wrong with camera. I mean, the camera tells the truth. And bringing this ongoing debate on body camera footage closer to home, you may remember the case of Andrew Brown Jr., who was shot by an Elizabeth City police officer in 2021. A judge ruled that only a portion of that footage could be released and viewed by family members. With the footage being released of the fatal beating of Tyree Nichols, Representative Brown says this. The truth needs to be told, and sometimes it can be a little harsh to see what actually happened but at least there's trans transparency and I think people will respect you more when they see that you're not trying to hide anything. I did reach out to several Republican lawmakers on the topic, but as of right now, we haven't received any statements or responses. If we do, we'll be sure to have their statements linked in our online article at WNCT.com. In studio, Caitlin Richards, 9 on your side.